Hi guys, welcome or welcome back. Today is not tea content. Today is apparently Benjamin's video, so he is going to tell you what we are looking at. Yeah, slash trying. yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, I was on Facebook the other day and Sam and I are really into our hot foods. We love hot foods. We've got a spice rack full of spices and we've got a sauce rack full of at least 22 sauces. And I saw these guys from, uh, you can hold that up for me. Wilkshire, Wilkshire Chili Farm, and we bought. I bought a range of bottles from them. Um, so let's start at the lowest one that we bought from them. I got this in a three for twelve pound deal. So we're going to turn you around and show you the colours, so you can see the spice levels and also tell you what they are. So first up, we have the mango chili sauce, which is uh, it says on it, you know, it's quite clearly mango and the heat. The heat scale is four out of five chilies, um, which on the website just said hot. And it's this nice kind of mustard yellowy brown color. Then we've got the Caribbean chili sauce, which is five out of five on the heat scale, which on the website said extreme. And it is a really nice orangey turning into red. So that's got some habaneros in it or something. And then we're moving on to the Naga chili sauce, which has obviously got Naga chilies in, which I presume is going to be rather warm again on the um, heat scale, is extreme. And this one is a dark red, turning to kind of a barbecue brown colour. And then this final little bad boy that you can't even see the colour of, what is it Ben? It, this is called Regret and it is actually written there, but it's just embroidered. Um, that guy is apparently 12 million Scoville's, so I thought I'd get it and we'd be silly and try it. So yeah, really, there's only one thing to further ado. Um, we've got four chicken dippers each, just bird's eye chicken dippers. We're going to go from um, coolest to hottest in my perception. We have got pizza as well, but that's also just also got that pizza. Uh, I've also put mayonnaise here because we usually eat pizza with mayonnaise and then I'll cool it down if need be. I've got a glass of water and because we are a tea channel, we both have a cup of tea. Where's your cup of tea going? I drink it. Well, I made us both a milky cup of tea to kind of cool our tongue. Ben did have a Bird and Blends coffee tea, the Afagon, Afag, Afagata, Afag... I've drank it, it's gone. It was in a previous subscription box if you want to check that out. It was one that I said that I didn't like, but I thought he would and he does. And I am drinking Adagio's Butterscotch as a latte. So we're gonna have a chicken dipper each and with each one of the sauces we started from the coolest to the hottest. Um, um, we can't really say a lot more. I'll tell you the ingredients as we go along, but yeah, let's have this first one. I don't think it's gonna be that hard. We can definitely smother the chicken dipper in this guy, but we'll tell you about the sauce. Mm. It kind of has a reminiscence of fish and chip curry sauce. Yeah, it does actually. I agree with that. A little bit sweeter. It's really nice. Yeah, it's really good. Really, really enjoying that one. For our taste palette, not spicy though. No, not spicy. You know, with a slight hint. Remove this one. Yeah, I was just going to read the ingredients really quick. So we've got mango, sugar, cider vinegar, onion, lime juice, garlic, habanero, habanero chili, mustard, spices and some salt. But yeah, I would recommend that straight out the back if you it has a little bit of a after tingle. Uh, it's not an after kick, I wouldn't say. It's got a little bit of a tingle at the back of my mouth. Yeah. All right, chicken dipper, high fives. What have we got next? We got the um, Caribbean chili sauce. A little bit weird with the chicken dipper, but mm. tell me more, tell me more. You're not waiting for me on this. Mm -mm. That's really nice. So I can see on the ingredients here that it's got orange bell peppers in it. You can try that straight away. It's sizzling with habanero chilies, ghost chilies, and orange bell pear <laughs> berries. Bell. Orange bell peppers. So just orange peppers if you're from England. Yeah. This fiery yet sweet hot sauce can bring spiced Caribbean sunshine to your kitchen. That is good. I'm and this does remind me of um, Antigua. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is good. I really like the peppery. It's really in there. Which again, it has a bit of an after tingle in the mouth, but I wouldn't class this as really spicy. Yeah, I wouldn't class it as extreme. I'm pretty sure it's a done. It's mm. got five out of five there. But we have lived in a lot of countries where spicy food is the main we food. We are used to it, yeah, and we eat a lot of spicy food. We love spice. But I would not say that's a five chilli. No, I would say that's maybe a 
three to four out of five. I'd say the mango and chili is probably a three, I'd and say the Caribbean is a similar, four. Very similar spice, to be honest. I don't, I haven't noticed any heat. The Caribbean has a longer after linger. Mm, mm. Right, it's gonna. I think it's gonna get a little bit hotter now. Um, the ingredients in this one are pretty much. Na it's sixty percent naga chili, cider vinegar, and then water. I can't even read that muscova ado, garlic and salt. But yeah, without further ado, let's get chicken okay. dipper high five in there. Oh, saucy chicken dipper! Mmm. Oh, that one's got, that one's definitely got an aftertaste. Oh yeah, yeah, that's After definitely. That. This one tastes quite similar to uh, a Carolina Reaper um, mm. sauce that we have. Mm. I really like that one. That is definitely sitting in the back of my throat for yeah, longer though. That's warmer. Ooh. We are building up of course as well and now we're going to go straight to the... I'm going to enjoy that for one more second. But yeah, so far I'd say that one, the mango one. And that one of my favourite, the Naga. What I want to do, I want to have a slice of pizza Before. with mayo and kind of just clean our mouths out. I agree. Okay, I'm going to do that off camera though. Okay. I'm not, I'm going to do it on camera. <laughs> okay, so we've pizza sliced up, we've had a little bit of mayo. And this Naga one. It's still going a little bit. Is definitely lingering. I like it though. It's on my tongue. It's definitely still warm. Right, so... The regret bottle, the, uh, the apparent 12 million Scoville bottle. We've only got the tiniest, tiniest little drop on there. Because how much we had of the others compared to this one. We don't want to, uh, we don't want to be silly now. And it does literally say on the back of the bottle, warning, hot sauce used as food additive only. Now that would mean put it in a sauce or something, <laughs> or just add it to this chicken dipper right here. Cause that, 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 that's addi additive, yeah. It also came with a warning to only use while wearing gloves. Well, it said that on the website. Which we're clearly doing. I believe. Yeah. Anyway, without further ado, 12 million Scovilles and I'm gonna go for her. I'm quite worried about I'm this. I'm coating my mouth. Here we go. Are you waiting? No, yeah, I'll wait for you. I'll just take the rest. I mean, I can feel it. But isn't that how all of the videos go? Like, oh yeah, I mean, I can feel it. And then like five minutes later, I'm on fire! It's definitely hot. <laughs> I've got a, four, a small forehead and sweat. But I'm okay so far. I'm okay as well. My spice really tolerance nice. is a little bit bigger than Ben's just because I started eating spicy food before he did, but kind of a background of our relationship when we met, you liked spice but you weren't into that and then I've slowly no. crept him up to where I'm at. I would not say that's the spiciest thing I've ever tasted. No, I've made spicy sauce in Mexico ourselves. I've but, accidentally made spicier pasta than that. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. I do overdo it definitely. with the spice of the pasta sometimes. <laughs> I'll tell you a funny story about chilies and sauces while we're there. While I was in Mexico, I was making a big group of green habanero sauce. And uh, I was <laughs> chopping away at the chilies. Oh, that? Sorry, and I thought you were going to say La, 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 chopping away, doing some garlic, whatever. I blended it and I was like, whoa, I've been drinking, had a few beers in the day. Then I went to the toilet. Whoops, I didn't wash my hands beforehand because I was super desperate. Oh my god. For about half an hour, I sat in the shower with cold water running on my... Self. ...area. And yeah, that was the, one of the most painful things I've ever done. I thought you were going to say about when we were in Cancun and me, Marion had it's a... It's definitely warm, guys. It's definitely warm. I'm going to be honest. And all your sauces, Wilkshire chilli. Oh, they taste great. They taste great. Even that, like, you know, I was expecting it to be like, it's really hot on my tongue right now. Uh-huh. But that's, that's sort of, you just put your tongue in it. Yeah. It's hotter if you ignore the chicken dipper. <laughs> are you being silly, are you? <laughs> what are we do? No, don't move your finger, you might touch your eye. Or again, with your area. Oh, I, I can feel it. 
my the tip of my tongue slightly feels like it might drop off in a second. That was my cup of tea. I need some pizza and some mayo. Quick. You've got you want more mayo. I need a that's gone right to the back of my throat. Let me know in the comments what your go-to pizza condiment is. Mm. We are mayo pizza drinkers, eaters. <laughs> it is hot. And if you're not used to spicy food, that probably would kill you. But it's not the spiciest thing I've ever had. You've got to bear in mind, we only had a tiny, teeny bit as well. But it I does stuck like... my tongue in it. Yeah. I like it. It's nice. It's quite expensive, I'm not going to lie, that was £15 a bottle, but I felt like trying it. You know, why not? But Wilkshire, Wilkshire Chili Did you bone. tell me the price while we're recording so that I can't tell you off? Yeah, that was exactly what was going on there. To be fair, I'm not angry at that because you're not going to use much. No, you won't use much, it's like... I also feel like this is going to be a really good one to mix with the mayo, just to have it and sauce it in. Boom, that's a good fridge. idea. I was thinking really nice in chilli con carne, just a couple of dashes in your chilli. Ooh, I wonder if that would be nice in my lapsang chilli. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Is this our first mukbang? Huh? Your first what? Mukbang. Mukbang? Mukbang! What the fuck is a mukbang? Hello? A mukbang! What's a mukbang? Have you never heard mukbang? No. It's a YouTube video where you just eat and you talk. Oh right, yeah, this is our first mukbang. We weren't eating, we were talking a lot more than we were eating, but now we're eating. Now we're eating. I can still feel it on my tongue, but mm. I'm not in pain. Mm -mm. Mm. Are we doing order a favour? Mm -mm. <laughs> Fuck. Mm. Let's do order a favour though. Okay. I'd say for flavour, mango was my favourite, then regret, naga. Actually no, then regret, Caribbean, naga. 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 No way. Mine's very similar. It's that though. So mine was mango, naga, regret, and then Caribbean. Don't get me wrong, I really like the Caribbean and I really like the pepper in it. I really like the flavour of it. Yeah. Not the spiciness, but the flavour. You said that about all of them. No, no this has definitely got a kick. To it. Did I? Okay. I mean, I was expecting this to be one of those videos where we're going to be crying. Mm. So was I. It's a sauce though, it's not a raw chilli, you know what I mean? Mm. I got really nice. I had one almost tear when I stuck my tongue in this. <laughs> we're just hard. We're just hard people, that's what it is. We do we do eat a lot of hot sauce things, like on pizza we have cayenne pepper and onion. We make spicy mayo. Mm -hmm. Our pasta's ridiculously spicy. Anyway, you don't need to know about our whole life. Wiltshire chili farm. Is it what's just oh, keep on. Wilkshire Chili Farm, guys, I like your sauces. I'll probably buy one again. Fearless flavour. Oh, they also Obviously, we've gone for your hot range. You've got a lot cooler range. And guys, if you see it, check it out. But they've been popping up on my Facebook for a few days. And I was like, sod it. I'm going to get involved. Because we were, we were getting under the 20 range in the sauces. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think that'll do from us. But yeah, awesome. Thanks for listening. Subscribe down below. And I don't know the rest. If you liked this video, please <laughs> give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see other videos similar, then let us know in the comments what other kind of foods slash things you would like us to try. Please consider subscribing. We are so close to the 300, which means we are so close to 1,000, which means what, Ben? Goals. He's getting me. better. Goals. Goals and pizza. All right, we hope you're having a fantastic day. Maybe not with your mouth on fire like apparently Ben does. And just, we'll just see you in the next now. one. I got, I, got, I got a bit of roof and mouth on fire now. Right, see right. you later. Bye-bye. <laughs>